Welcome back to Legendary. Today we're gonna eat hot pot, one of my favorite meals in Asia. So it's gonna be Heidi Lau hot pot here at MBS or Shopee's at MBS. And we're gonna enjoy some very good food. Let's go. Especially on rainy or cloudy days, I often crave hot pot. It's my first time to visit the Heidi Lau branch at Shopee's at MBS. The restaurant is located at B2 level and at the entrance you'll find a waiting lounge which provides customers with free water and wintermelon drinks as well as some chips and other snacks while waiting for their table. Globally, Heidi Lau is one of the best hot pot places, especially known for its impeccable service and free gifts to the customers. Once it's your turn, you will be shown to your table where you can use an iPad to start ordering your soup bases and thereafter the ingredients you want to enjoy today. This normally includes some nice meats, vegetables, fish, tofu, cheese balls and whatnot. If it's your first time, I highly recommend the live noodle dance performance for which you need to order the Heidi Lau style noodles. I have been to Heidi Lau several times, but this is the first time I will try out the famous Heidi Lau secret hacks which promise to get customers some free stuff. In the next step, you will prepare for the meal by creating your own dipping sauces, which you can get at the free condiments and sauces station. That's right, it's free. There's so much variety at that condiments bar and you can also help yourself to some free fruits, porridge and desserts like grass jelly, soy pudding and much more. Heidi Lau, secret hack number one, getting a free fairy wand. Heidi Lau hack number two. Two two number two, kai. How can I eat two two? Wow, it's a bag. It's a bag. Hack number three. Your favorite dish is very good. Very good. Very good. Thank you. Hack number four. Your house is very good. Okay. Popcorn, cookies, more cookies, chips. Hack number five. Do you see me like a little friend? Really? I don't know if it's like a little friend. Wow! Wow! I really appreciate you. Thank you, thank you. Thank you. Wow! It's a... What is it? A shuttle. So now it's a really fun and cool experience coming to Heidi Lau again. We got this amazing fairy wand. Pow pow! And we have this little cute rabbit box where you can put something in. I think there's like a shoulder strap on top if you want to bring it somewhere or give it to one of your kids. Um, we actually got a free soup base packet. It's amazing. I love tomato. Popcorn. Biscuits, chips. Don't forget about the toy car. Zoom zoom. Hack number six. Menu, menu, menu. Hey, it's a menu. Ah, my my body, my body is very sore. Wow, is it really? Wow. 
Sit here. I think nobody has ever tried and shown this hack. It's a new one. And this one has given me a, um, yeah, literally a back massage or a neck massage. And you just say that your body is aching. You just say, what a senti and tong. And then you get maybe this. What we got is two quarters filled with two different soups. One is the tomato based soup and the other one is the, I don't know what's the name. Three delicacies. Three delicacies soup. The other two quarters are just with plain hot water for which we are going to make our own broth. Follow me to the sauce and condiments station. At the free condiments and sauce bar, we collected the ingredients to make our own two additional free soup bases. Unfortunately, we forgot to record the moment we added the first sauce into the pot. But we mix salt, chives, Thai chili, beef cubes and oyster sauce all together. The second clear water base will be filling with this Chinese uh, Sichuan cabbage with a lot of other ingredients which I will be showing on the display. This is a Chinese style, make your own hot pot broth. Now we're gonna try the different broths. So, we will start with the tomato soup. Mm. Very rich, bold tangy and very sweet from tomatoes. I think this is my favorite broth here in Heidi Lau. The next one is a three delicacy soup. Mm. Mm. So you can taste the mushroom and the Chinese herb taste. Mild but also yet very rich and creamy. Very delicious. Oh, oh, oh. Here comes one of our first self-made soups. Mm. Very peppery, Sichuan kind of spicy taste. Mm. And I can taste the soya bean sauce. I'd say it's a success. The very last one. Mm. I think with these two additionally safe made soups, we have a perfect combination of all four quarters. Let's enjoy. We have this whole plate of free tofu skin. Mm. It's already lightly seasoned. What you can also do is put this into the broth itself. Let it soak in the flavor. Mm. Delicious. What else is on the sauce part are these mushrooms. Oh my god, three mushrooms. Mm. All right, now we're gonna put in the shrimp paste. We're gonna drop some of these into the tomato. So let's try the beef short rib. Let's keep it in for a cooking time of maybe 15 seconds. Let's not cook it too long so it retains its juicy and tender texture. Now let's dip it into our own made sauce. Mm. Heaven. Nicely marbled. Mm. Thinly sliced, tender and very flavorful. I love it. One of my favorite dishes at Hot Pot is always the cheese tofu. I love it. Mmm, so soft. And the burst of molten cheese inside the tofu. In one of the recent YouTube videos, I saw that you can mix up the cooked sweet potato noodles with a nicely self-made peanut or sesame sauce. It just take some sesame sauce with some crushed peanuts, some spring onions, some Thai chilies, and just mix it all up together with the sweet potato noodles. And all these you can of course get from the free condiments and sauce bar. Mm. 
the sweet potato noodles have such a nice chewy texture. And they go so well with this peanutty and sesame kind of flavor from the sauce. Let's put the lamb in the broth. Oh sh yeah. <laughs> Let's put the lamb in the broth. Very fresh lamb, thinly sliced as well as the beef and it does not have a gamey flavor like some of the other lambs sometimes have and I would say it really absorbs all the flavor from the broth, super juicy and flavorful. So we are super full because we ordered a little bit too much as usual. But all this, what you can see here, watermelon, orange, soy pudding, glutinous rice, guava. It's all free food that you can get from the sauce and condiments bar. Amazing. The soy pudding is silky. Mildly sweet mm. and just and just goes down so easily and mm, it's free. <laughs> okay everyone, I think this was an amazing fun experience and great meal. The people are amazing here, it's fun, it's good. Recommend everybody to come try Heidi Lao, of course, if you have not tried it try the secret hacks as well. Let's at least try it once and it's uh, always a little bit of a fun interaction with the people. So, hope you enjoyed the video. Until next time, bye. We even got a photo frame with our photo printed out. Amazing gesture, amazing gift. Thank you Heidi Lau. For those who are interested in the prices, feel free to pause this last section of the video and check out the latest menu as of January 23, currency in Singapore dollars.